finally god damn it that took a lot of tries um hey guys welcome to another episode in the deep playthrough of grand Turismo 7. uh in the previous episode i accidentally pressed stop recording well i did not do any outro or anything but um yeah it is what it is i will move you through the This is the replay, I will walk you through the lab. This is the circuit experience of Deep Forest Raceway. Uh, it's quite tricky, pretty hard time, but here we go. So you start full throttle. Just go as fast as you can, and as soon as the curbing hits, uh, starts at the right side, you brake and go back to third, and you hug the inside corner over here as much as possible and then after you cross the midway point you can slowly but easily start opening up the um, accelerator the thr throttle and aim for the outside curb on the uh, straight just ahead so here and then here you start opening up and make, make use of the width of the track so you could you can use a little bit of the green as well Try to minimize your steering angle so that uh, you can maximize your amount of throttle input. The sharper you steer, the less throttle you can use. So you yeah, just make use of the width of the track to decrease your steering angle. Right, this is all full throttle. And here, oh by the way, it's easier if I do it like this. Over here you um, brake a little bit and lift off because there's a nasty little bump over here if you go too fast over here the rear end of your car gets light and you just lose it you spin out so here you go and then over here you can maybe depending on how fast you go do a little bit of throttle but immediately then uh, over here you need to start coasting uh, I, I don't think you need to brake you can uh, pretty much uh, be on those black rubber things over there with your left tire you can take it quite sharp over here which is also good because you want to be as straight as possible coming to the next hairpin which is just uh, up ahead so you can cut the corner here a little bit not fully then you will be disqualified and then over here immediately start uh, breaking hard back to seconds and here hug the inside and yeah somehow there's quite some grip in this corner so you can quite easily or early get on the gas already over here you really can start buying from it. maybe it's also the car with four wheel drive i don't know but there's quite some grip there and over here immediately similar type of corner immediately back to second so you you went from second to third and now immediately back to second break try to steer in as sharp as possible again to then uh, afterwards minimize your steering angle and maximize your uh, ability to apply throttle so over here it's very sharp almost no throttle and then as soon as you start opening up start applying uh, throttle and aim for that little green patch over there and immediately once you hit it preferably in third gear by that time uh, steer to the left because there's a left corner coming up so that is over here you can take it quite uh, sharp to fourth and as soon as you hit that little curbing on the right just briefly tap the brakes to move the weight of the car and yeah basically it's straight ahead there will be a curb coming up on the left no braking just coast along it try to hug it and as soon so here hug along it and as soon as you see the curb uh, in the distance coming up you can even apply uh, a bit of throttle and over here it is very briefly full throttle and over here once the light part starts on the road start to break um, hard more than you think you should and then because this corner you very easily um, uh, go wide so brake really don't take too much speed because that allows you to to steer in correctly sharp hit the apex to the left over there the curb 
uh, and then as soon as you can uh, get earlier get on the throttle again which is very important because there's a long straight coming up ahead so here steer in and then again as early as possible um, straighten up the car to maximize throttle uh, input but uh, you have to be careful, you can go quite wide on that green patch over there, but as soon as you go wide over where the patch is, uh, not yet, uh, but on the um, white line before it, uh, just uh, to the right, if you go over there with four wheels, then you are disqualified. So, yeah, but you must make sh use of this uh, bit of extra uh, tarmac to be able to straighten up uh, as soon as possible to be able to apply full throttle as soon as possible which is really important because of the long straight uh, up ahead so here I'm, I'm not sure if I'm now four wheels wide over the line it, it looks to be maybe there are two tires still uh, or one tire still on the uh, on the white line I have no idea but I'm not disqualified here so I'm just making use of the width of the track and 125 brake hard back to seconds over here you brake and here you can even cut this corner it's very slow you're almost standing still but it's a super tight hairpin you can hug this curb a bit i think it, it may actually help you steer in sharper compared to staying fully on the tarmac it's a little bit grippy, sticky, so to say. And then as soon as you uh, see the curbs over there, you can also go quite a little bit wide. So again, open up as soon as possible. And while opening up the steering wheel, proportionally apply more uh, throttle. And again, very important here because the long straight is coming up. These are uh, this that bent just after the bridge. And uh, this band they are really important because uh, the uh, long straights that uh, follow them. Right, so this is all full throttle just to the finish line. very nice it, it looks uh, easy and I make it maybe if I'm explaining it uh, making it sound easy but this really took me uh, at least 50 turns I think um, anyways let's quickly watch the full replay outside replay Five. 
time uh, and then almost standing still so slow and then over here full throttle again track but I'm pretty sure that we did do uh, a license test here I think in a Nissan GTR or something so. cool sound by the way quite visceral um, yeah so we finished it very nice Guys, as mentioned, I have to keep the episode a bit shorter because yeah, it's super late. I still have to eat something. Um, hope you enjoyed. Uh, hope to see you in the next one tomorrow after work. I will be continuing. And for the meantime, do not forget to always do Keep On Gaming Selector. Bye.